It's time to hit the road for season two of Yes's Ultimate Road Trip. We chose four passionate New York Yankees fans to travel across the country following the Bronx Bombers for an entire season of baseball. They'll be living together, playing together, and taking on challenges that lie ahead. So buckle up and join us. Hello. Hey, how are you, Marty? Julio. After the loss, uh, we were headed out here ready to play wiffle ball and uh, have some fun. All right, guys. So this is the back. This is the back door area here. You know, this oh, look is. At the uh, court. Oh, and a basketball court. Look at that case. You walk out back, and there's a badminton court. There's a tennis court. There's a half a basketball court. We're gonna take gate C right now. Gate All C. Right. Look at that. And then he takes us around to the other side and walk up to like what appears to be a, a home run fence. And you look over, and there's a wiffle ball field. No way. What? Uh uh. Look at this. Are you kidding me? I have never in my life seen a wiffle ball court. I mean, with a scoreboard, with a bench, with teleped up to the game. You got target signs, you got home runs, you got foul poles. There's advertising, there's a press box, there's people in the press box. It was absolutely amazing to see the thought that went into this. These people take their wiffle ball seriously, and I think we realized that uh, we would have to play to the level of our competition. It turns out this is the creme de la creme of all other fans that aren't Yankee fans playing against us. We had a Met fan, we had a Chicago fan, we had a Dodger fan. Let's go, gang. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. Be nice to me, Seaver. Be nice to me, brother. Oh, all right. Good eye. Good eye. Good eye. Let it be. Let it be. That was hard. Marty Rackham takes his face. Bova. 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 I'm scared. As Maria Bova. Am I saying the name right? Yes. Maria Bova at the plate. We don't get a lot of women down here at Strawberry Field, but that might have to do with hygiene. The live announcers were hilarious. Bova currently on antidepressants, and that's good news for everybody. Tiffany Berryman comes up to face Mike Dunning one on, one out. You know, if it hits the 10, then that's a strike, and it's really no room for arguing. She lets that one go by like she's waiting for something. Did I just strike out? I struck out looking. <laughs> and I heard that 10 a couple times. <laughs> I just struck out looking. <laughs> I'm totally Aaron. I'm totally Aaron. never heckling Aaron again. Pull up a bone, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah! That one hits the dirt. Why couldn't you do that when I was up, Seaver? <laughs> when in doubt, I'll just talk trash. They call him KJ because social path is too hard to pronounce. Oh! 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 Good pitch. God, I'm looking. That's all right. Shake that off. The game was tough. They are wiffle ball professionals if there is such a thing. KJ is on the mound for the Yankees. Uh, Woo! Strike one. Wasting no time. KJ pitched a phenomenal first couple in. Oh, oh, wow. wow. yeah. That's a little bit too tough. His pitches were sick. They were, I mean, I mean, I heard people in the stands, you know, saying that how impressed they were with the stuff that he was throwing. Got him! Oh, yeah. oh strike him! I could kind of see it in their eyes once I struck out that first guy that you know, I was going to have a good night, and I struck out every guy's face. We went up early, three runs. Oh. KJ got every bit of that one. Tiffany made a great catch tonight. Yes, you should. Go, go. She caught it underneath her leg, behind her back, and somehow came up with the ball before it touched ground. Yeah! <laughs> they quickly learned that we were not here to play around, we were here to win. You know, it was back and forth, and, and then it just kind of all went to hell. Get it, Tim! Oh, no! Unfortunate miscues in the field. Oh, Maria! Oh, my God! When I came into pitch, I did horribly. Ah! Before you know it, the bases are loaded, and I gave up a meatball. Oh, oh. oh my goodness! Dylan Bob says, Julio, I'm taking your best pitch, and I'm driving it into a fruit tree. And before you know it, they put up a seven spot on the board. They got seven, we can get seven. Let's go, here we go. We came up with our last at-bats, and uh, we put up a nice little rally. There you go, you walk, baby. Yeah! yeah. Come on. Base is loaded for you, man! And then uh, Marty comes up. Go, go, go! Yeah! 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 
<laughs> it was 10-7, but uh, these boys are really, really, really out of our league at this point. Uh, Little dribbler. My daddy was no problem. We just tried our hardest. We played our hearts out. We ended up losing the game 10-7. Good game, Artie. Yeah, good, good game. Good game. Yeah. I've played wiffle ball many times in my life. Never like this. This is by far the most fun I've ever had playing wiffle ball.